Euphorbiaceae family is commonly known as rubber family. The identification hints of this particular family are plants with milky sap, juice or latex, sepals and petals either similar or absent altogether, ovary is superior and tricalparary, one of the largest family of angiosperms with 290 genera and 7500 species. 422 species, sorry, 442 species are recorded in India. Taxonomic classification, plague kingdom plantae, sub-kingdom phenerogams, that is seed-bearing plant, class dicotyledone, division, monoclabid, series, unisexuals, order, euphorbials and family, euphorbiaceae. Habit, mostly shrubs and trees, that is uh, bischopia, amblica and hevia are trees few are herbs like acalypha euphorbia philanthus urinaria and amara etc herbs are annual or perennial erect or prostrate some are climbers like tragia family exudes acrid juice or latex exception are philanthus amblica and sarcococca Stems fleshy or spiny and occasionally modified into cladodes or philoclades. Philoclades or cladophyll and cladode. This is the modification of stem. Stems become modified to become flattened and swollen called philoclades. Remember stem modified flattened or swollen is philoclade. This philoclade contain chlorophylls hence green in color which perform the function of photosynthesis cladode is a type of uh, philoclade which has one internode here leaves are reduced to scales or spines remember philoclade as well as cladode can be used as propagating material in vegetative propagation and this is most popular in many of the forest tree species distribution widely distributed except in the arctic regions leaves are simple rarely divided and or compound alternate and sometimes opposite stipules are small or sometimes replaced by glands or thorns in xerophytic desert plant desert plants leaves are reduced to scales or spines or fall of early or end stem itself perform the function of photosynthesis that means along with leaves here stems also play vital role in photosynthetic activity so the yield metabolic yield will be higher as compared to other families inflorescence it is a complex type first branching in racemos and subsequent one or uh, cymos or all are in cymos in euphorbia a special type of inflorescence called cyanthium the Acalypha, the inflorescence is catkin type. Cyanthium. Here, flowers are cymosely arranged in a cup shaped invacor, which is often provided with nectaries. The inflorescence have several stamens and a solitary carpel, each one representing single flower. The whole inflorescence looks like a single flower, but here it is collection of several flowers. That means a whole inflorescence look like a single unit and bearing several flowers is known as cyanthium catkin inflorescence here also you may find several flowers in a single form this is a long and pendulous spike bearing sessile without stalk unisexual flower flowers are small bracteate regular hypogynous or perigynous bracts usually sepaloid or sometimes rarely petaloid always unisexual monoecious or dioecious coming to corolla that is uh, petal perianth occasionally calyx and corolla present example in croton it is present in majority of the cases either calyx or corolla or both are absent if calyx corolla present it is four to five perianth in where no differentiation into calyx and corolla present in four to five in one or two worlds and is diff different male and female flowers. Male flowers are naked, that is perianth is absent and 
cauliflower is represented usually by single stalked stamen and in sometimes stamens may be many like in resinous that is castor velvet or imbricate estivation androsium stamens uh, may be varying in its number usually it is equal to the number of uh, perianth leaves in euphorbia single stalked stamens in male flower in ricinus that is castor five stamens each stamen profused branches in jatropha 10 stamens in two whorls of five each in many stamens are indefinite gynosium tree carpels three carpels that is tricarpellary syncarpus trilocular and superior gynosium each locule contains one or two pendulous anatrophous ovules exile platementation three stigma and it is trifid remember in case of euphorbiaceae family stigma are trifid here the trifid picture is shown clearly this is trifid shape usually in case of cereals we find the bifid stigma like this and in euphorbiaceae it is trifid fruit is sesocarpic sesocarpic means derived from the bi or multicarpellary syncarpus ovary and is split up into one seeded parts in such a way that a portion of pericarp always surrounds each seed the floral formula here we may find the hermaphrodite flowers as well as unisexual flowers calyx is 0 to 5 that means it may be 0 or 5 corolla 0 to 5 androsium 1 to 5 or infinity then gynosium is superior and 3 in number economic importance of euphorbiaceae family it has immense economic importance first importance is as a subsistence amlica officinalis philanthus indofisheri manihot esculenta Bacuria cortelensis etc has subsistence property as a medicine that is mellitus filiophyensis balisporimum mantanum putrenchava roxbergi philanthus urinaria etc has medicinal value as a biodiesel chatropa carcass as rubber hevia brasiliensis timber Biscophia javanica as a ornamental, Acalypha indica, Croton, Euphorbia, Antiquarum, then Euphorbia, Pulcherima, Euphorbia, Royalena, Jatropha, Gossipi, Gossipifolia, all are bearing ornamental property. As a dye like uh, Melotus filifensis, then Kiriginalia reticulata, etc. The first important species is Amlica officinalis, that is Indian gooseberry, Nelly or Amla. This is a common tree of uh, deciduous forest. Fruits are rich in vitamin C, widely used in pickling, jam, jelly, syrup, etc. Used as medicine for diarrhea, dysentery, bark and leaves for drying and tanning purpose. Wood yields excellent charcoal. Philanthus acidus has chromosome number 2 and equal to 98. Here I forgot to tell you the chromosome number of Amlica officinalis. It is 28 in diploid form. Philanthus acidus is 2 and equal to 98 to 104. Also called as Raginelli. This is another form of uh, Philanthus officinalis. Okay? But this is mainly cultivated in the urban side. And Philanthus officinalis is found in forest. Hevia brasiliensis is 2n equal to 2x equal to 36, is para rubber or rubber plant. Native to Brazil, widely grown in Kerala, Tamil Nadu, Karnataka, and North northeastern states. Latex from the bark used in rubber making, close to 21 million tons of rubber were produced, which is approximately 42% which is natural asia is the main source of natural rubber according to about 94 percent output 2.7 lakh tons of rubber produced in 2012 and 13. malotus philippinesis is 2 and equal to 22 that is kumkumadamara means 
where million is prepared out of this plant small trees distributed in the evergreen and uh, semi evergreen forests of western ghats west bengal madhya pradesh maharashtra and orissa a red dye obtained from the surface of the fruit as a medicine for treat worms and ascaris also jatopa carcass is 2n equal to 2x equal to 22 also called as safed arant or gotaga it is a small shrub with acrid juice seeds yield biodiesel oil used for burning lamps making candles soaps and lubricants oil is also used as purgative diabetes rocks burgi or child life tree <clears throat> This is a tall deciduous tree for forest tree grown as a hedge plant nuts are made into rosaries or necklaces and folk believe that if placed around the neck of children it keeps the children in good health seed sealed oil for burning lamps leaves good for the leaves fruits are as medicine for colds and fever resinous cumulus is castor to n equal to 20 this is a small shrub cultivated for its oil oil for purgative and as a lubricant oil is used in making candle soaps typewriter ink varnishes etc seed cake is a good fertilizer manihot esculenta to an equal to 36 is tapioca or sakarand this is a small shrub like um, castor native to brazil grown in kerala tamil nadu karnataka for its timber tuber purpose starch sago and flour obtained from the tuber carica papaya to n equal to 18 common fruit type this is rich source of vitamin a baliospermum mentalum is danti plant aporosa lindreyana is salle plant then other ornamental really important plants like euphorbia antiquatum which is habituated to desert condition euphorbia threrocalli euphorbia trigona euphorbia pulcherima euphorbia other species then centenium grandi are the other ornamental plants thank you i hope the information furnished on your forbiaceae family for you is informative and if you like this video please do not forget to keep on sharing subscribing liking and commenting thanks for patience watching